We are back with another episode of Isaiah's Crazy Life. Now, I actually recorded this video already, so we are multiple days ahead, like very, very far ahead. But we didn't have any audio in that whole entire video. So let's do a quick recap. So Jonathan has moved out and he currently lives in a little home in Windenburg, pursuing his lifestyle in villainy. Isaiah and Corey went on not one, but two dates. They went on a date to the Love Romance Festival, and then they just went on a spontaneous date to a bar. We have completed all of our homework and we've gotten started on our term papers. We just need to edit them to make sure that they're good. Today is the last day of class, so I think we just need to submit them. So he's going to class right now. He's actually late because he just woke up out of bed. Oh, he also has a beard. See now, I have to deal with this beard even longer because I was going to ask you guys if we should shave it off or if we should keep the beard. So he just missed his, his final class. He just missed his exam because he was late sleeping. Ashley, why are you calling us already? Today made me so angry. One guy just kept asking me about my day over and over again. You think I'm going to just be your friend if you keep repeating the same questions over and over again? Sheesh. Some Sims. We got three options today. I've never had a three option, three option one. So let's spin the spinner. Try to calm her down. You know, Isaiah, it's probably not good to try to calm a girl down, but we got it. Calm down, calm down. What do you think I am? Calm down when I'm ready to calm down. Or I'll calm down when I'm ready to calm down. I, I told you not to do it, Isaiah. I told you not to do it. Send her a quick text. Where's our class at? Go to class now, take your exam. And then since he's off at class, where is the house at? Cause that's his only class today, right? We're gonna come back home and we're gonna submit the term paper. Ugh. Corey wants to know if we wanna go over and hang out. But where's his, does he have his laptop on him? Okay, he has it. Just in case it says accept, you know, we never know what these things are gonna say. Let's see, oops. Heads, looks like we're going over to Corey's house. Let's head over. She just literally lives in the dorm right here. Hello, Corey. Oh, propose? You want to propose to Corey? Oh, that is also another thing. They became officially boyfriend, girlfriend. But now I need him to come up here and use his computer real quick. Oh, Isaiah is feeling particularly loyal and committed to this relationship these days. Trust is important to him. Embrace the change. And I said if he discovered something, he should always just say yes. So we're going to say yes. Anyways, I need to come on here. University coursework, term paper, submit both of them. We're not going to revise them like I wanted to. We'll do that next time. University coursework, term paper, submit, submit. And then we can go hang out with Corey. Because then that's it. We are all officially done with school, right? I think, anyways. What is $90? You just bought coffee for $90? Are you even tired? I mean, come over here and get a snack, but why are you gonna buy a coffee? Dang, we gotta pay over here? <laughs> so we got our final, our final grades. <laughs> we are currently on probation. We literally got a D, an A minus, an F, and a D. Look, Isaiah, if you just show up to class on time and do your homework, you wouldn't be in this in this predicament. It's time to sign up for classes. Well, sh I guess let's spin the wheel or let's spin it. Are we signing up for another term? Or yes or no? Heads, okay, we are signing up for another term. Let's lower the classes this time and let's get into, there's no more fitness on here for his, his like lifestyle thing. So I guess we can do the video game one because he likes video games and uh, Let's, dang, 840 to live here? Let's spin the wheel. We got three houses to pick from. Three, two, one, spin that wheel. Of course, of course, I swear this game wants to be in the most expensive things each time. We lost one of our scholarships because we dropped out of the video game thing because it kept getting in the way of our date with Corey over and over and over again. So, we're, so we lost one of our scholarships. You guys were wondering. That happened in the last episode. Okay, let's go to the Humor and Hygiene Festival and check out the fireworks. I hear they have the best fireworks show in town. Let's spin the wheel. We're doing a lot of spinning today. Tails, looks like we're going to stay here and hang out with Corey instead. Oh, passionate kiss. <laughs> so I, I'm looking at Corey right now and... And she has a bump. She has a baby bump. So now... Unless Corey is cheating, it has to be Isaiah's. Unless Corey is cheating, it has to be Isaiah's baby. And I did not know, because otherwise I would not have signed up for another semester in school. Now, if you're wondering how this happened, 
we did not try for a baby, except I have it on 50 50 for a chance at getting pregnant. And they've been doing a lot of spontaneous woohoo with the MC Command mod. So it appears that she got caught up in that. She can't be in another semester of school. We can't be in another semester of school. Where is she gonna have the baby at? Okay. You know, he has to go to the bathroom, so let's go fix up our needs. Oh, it's just the bathroom. That's it. What a lucky girl she is. Can we snoop for secrets? We can pillow fight with her. Is that like, they actually pillow fight? What does that even mean? To have- Vlad is here? Oh my gosh. Why is Vlad here? <laughs> just pillow fighting. You know, we need to check. We haven't checked in a long time, actually. Social bunny. I didn't search social bunny at all last time. Okay, where are we? A lot has popped off on social bunny. We're not really, it says zero minutes ago. All of these say zero minutes ago. So like, I really don't know what's new, but where did we leave off last time? Unless none of that is here anymore. Well, we reacted to that one, right? Cause once you react to it, it goes away. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know, but let's see. Isaiah, you don't have to laugh at my jokes. I can laugh for both of us. It's because you're not funny. A pillow smack to my soul. It will take days to crawl out of this hole of sadness. Isaiah, you don't have to laugh at my jokes. Why is she just saying the same thing as Ashley? Or did Ashley, or did she say that first and then Ashley said it? Isaiah listened to these old folks telling us they couldn't get out of the pool with the ladder. Hit the gym. Guys, I really need your help now. We're on probation, Corey's pregnant, and like, I feel like we just need to drop out and like go take care of the baby. I mean, it's not here yet, but we are not making any money right now. We're just here to have fun. Like we're gonna have to get a second job. We're gonna have to get a job actually, not a second one, but just a job in general. So that way we can support, so we can support our mistakes. I'm not sure how we can make, like I know how to make money in The Sims, right? Like, there's a lot of ways to make money in The Sims. Like we could be a video game streamer. We can enter tournaments. Let's enter a tournament right now. What's he doing? The tournament's almost over. Let's see if we want any type of money. It turns out the other competitors in this tournament were better than Isaiah. No prize this time. Isaiah, you need to do better. Maybe, oh my God, it's five o'clock in the morning. I was gonna say, maybe it's time to go home. We just need, the coffee's gone. We are gonna go take a nap over here because why are we gonna go home when it's already time for, to go to class practically? We only did one homework. Isaiah, you're already falling behind this semester. Let's go to class. We should probably leave Corey's apartment too. Like, or not apartment, but her dorm. We've been there all day. And who's this? Oh, hey, so this might be a bad time, but I came back to our place and I seem to have um, locked myself out. Haha, <laughs> silly me. So could you come home? Like no rush, but right now would be good. I have to go to class. I literally have to go to class right now. Like, what are you talking about? If you're locked out, you're locked out. So our next class starts at what, 1.30? 30? 30 minutes. Well, we'll go to class. We'll go to class early. Congrats on landing that sweet job. I think this is going to be great for you. I don't even have a job. I did not realize that the camera was out of focus. So I don't know how long it was out of focus for, but we're back now. Class is done. Everything's finished. Let's head home. Then are you still locked out? Packing up and moving out. As Isaiah has selected a different university housing for the next term, he should take some time to pack up everything that's his before the move out. Yeah, I honestly already forgot that we selected a new dorm. So we'll just sleep until packing up is over. Cause I don't think we had anything else. We got our laptop and we got the fridge. Gonna miss having the pool though. Moving out. It's now time for Isaiah to move on and move out. Okay. Okay, so I forgot that Corey lives there. So it's giving me all of her money. I don't want, I don't want that. I don't want Corey in my household right now. Okay, now that that is settled up, let's go fix our needs, take a shower. What do you guys want us to do? Corey is living back on Mount Cormorebi, not in her original house. Somebody else lives there, so I just gave her another house. Does Isaiah like keep going to school? I mean, he has a history degree, like to be a politician. Like, let's be honest, is he gonna use that? Like, no offense, no offense to him. So it's 10 o'clock, are we tired? We're not terrible tired. Like, so should we share a room or should we get one of these upstairs rooms that's by ourselves? Like this is Corey's old room. It's still Corey's room. Okay, okay, now that we're up and at it. So we need to do a term paper, a final exam. Maybe we get started on the presentation now since our needs are pretty good right now. We're gonna do this semester better, you know what I mean? Like last semester we just wrote the term paper and then that's it. 
We didn't even edit it or nothing like that. All right, when do we go to class? At 3 p.m. We have class really late, actually. Oh, we haven't even done the homework. What do you mean just started? I told you to do this homework yesterday. Nobody's even in that room, and it's all the way on the blast. It's on blast. Like, that music was all the way up for what? Nobody's in there. Playing that ghetto song. Ugh, Ashley. Ugh, like, why would we want to come over there and hang out with you? Exactly, exactly. No. You were screaming at us last time. Oh, I never edited my money back. We have like 2,000 simoleons. 2,000 and something simoleons. We started a... I almost submitted that. Hold on. University co coursework term paper. Submit. Did we, fi we, did we finish that? I guess we can submit it. I thought we had to work on it still. Okay, that was really weird. I just... I don't even know. We have three hours to a class. So, I really... I'm, this is the first time with Isaiah that I don't even know what to do. What if they got food in the bathroom? Why is there a guitar in the bathroom? Why are you eating in the bathroom? There's all these seats over here. And you pick to eat in the bathroom. And like, I don't know why he's still walking when he has a bike. Is his bike in his inventory? It is. Preferred bike and everything, so I don't even know. What we should do after class is go visit Corey because Corey is pregnant. Like we should go check on our baby. All right, she lives in, the, in this house. All right, so she hasn't had the baby yet. So let's ask the baby's due date. Who is this? Hey, Isaiah, I've been thinking about getting to know Trout Young. Better, better as a friend. Do you think the two of us should hang out? I don't care. I literally could care less about Trout. But since it is a thing, we have to spin the wheel. Number two. Maybe, to be honest, I'm not sure. Um... Brush. Snuggle. Oh, freeze. <laughs> Tell a funny story. Give a massage. Oh, he gotta go to he gotta go to the bathroom. He gotta eat. We gotta do some homework too. You know, I know she's off. You know, she doesn't have homework no more. But some of us do. But first, we're just gonna eat. So what is this? She made it one little salad. Let's get our homework done. The blip block class, and then. Pathways of colonization. What is she doing? Why is she doing university homework? If she's not enrolled anymore. Why is he sleeping in this little bed when he can come up here and sleep in like the bed with Corey? I don't know if Corey will come up here and sleep. She, why is she taking a nap? She needs to get in bed and sleep. She's just doing anything she wants to do basically. Oh, today's Harvest Fest, so we don't even have class today. It says class in six hours though. This time we won't kick the gnomes. I don't even know where are they. There, there goes one. I thought that was one right there, but I think one is right. There's only one gnome. Easy peasy. A piece of gnome, give, give a future cube. Yeah. You're telling me in this huge house, there's only one gnome. But when we had our apartment, we had like six gnomes in there. You know, since I don't think we have class today, maybe what we can do since we're in Mount Komarevi is we can go hit the slopes. We don't have a presentation, so we can't work on that either. But like he's autonomously doing university homework, which is what? Scientific progress. Wait, so we do still got to go to class because it just said it just said class starts in an hour. He has like a full grown beard in now and it used to just be like that like Jonathan wants to know if we want to come over to his house. We actually really haven't seen Jonathan's house yet. So he's gonna invite us up for a harvest fest. That's nice. And it looks like we're not going though, so it doesn't matter. University, it doesn't matter if they, if it's a holiday or not. Like he still has to go to class, which to me doesn't make sense, but okay. Why are you calling me again? I'm delighted you recommend I spend some time with Trout Young. I was amused the entire time. Good on you, girl, good on you. You know, I thought we didn't have to worry about class when it came to holidays, but you know, jokes on us, right? Get your food, get your food, get your food, get your food. A chocolate croissant, man. I've been trying to get him to work on his presentation for like an hour and he just has not went yet. See, we're doing way better on this homework thing now. So tomorrow we have the scientific pro a progress. So let's do that one. That homework and let's get that out of the way. Oh, he's still refining it. So good job, Isaiah. Who's calling us? Hello, Isaiah, Corey here. I want to let you know that I just had Lucas, a beautiful baby boy. Okay, we gotta go, we gotta go. We gotta go to Cory, we gotta spend the night over there again. Da what do you mean you saw you me heading out? Like, get, leave me alone. I don't even, I don't even know you. I don't even know you. I don't even know you. And yet you're here with me 
to go meet my baby for the first time. You freaking weirdo. Do not, do not talk with him. Where's the baby at? Guys, look at this. He is such a father. I can't believe we had a baby. Like, we just have to, like, live here now. Like, there's no way we can, like, have her with the baby all day. You know what I mean? Let's give it a bottle and then let's come over here and talk to Corey. Bro, why is he in the house? I don't even know where he went. I don't even know. There he goes. Like, go home. And you know, earlier and I was like, there's only one gnome and now there's three of them. Like, where did the other two come from? Oh my gosh, the baby. But all right, guys, you know, it's Friday night or Friday in the game. So therefore I'm going to end off today's video right here. I hope you guys did enjoy today's video. A lot of has happened, you know. We are no longer just little Isaiah. We're Isaiah and Lucas and Corey. We're like a little family right here. So let me know what you guys think. Do you guys like Isaiah's beard, by the way? Should we drop out of university to come support the baby or should we stay in university? Let me know in the comments down below. And this has been Breezy and I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.